Hi everybody. Today I'm going to show you an exercise for thoracic mobility. So you'll uh, just need your mat and maybe a block or a pillow to level out your hips or and or pad the back knee. So we're going to come into a 90-90 position like this. So what you can do if you find one hips lower than the other, um, you want to have your hips level so you can place your knee on a block so that the hips are in line or just a pillow rolled up. So we're creating stability in the lower body. So push into the foot of the front leg, press into the top of the back foot, tuck the tailbone down and forward gently to lengthen, create space in your lower back. And then what we're going to do, we're going to cross the arms. You're going to take an inhale. This is where you feel you're lengthening the spine. And as you exhale, we're going to rotate towards the front knee side. We're going to come back on the inhale. And then as you exhale again, we're going to rotate away from the front knee side. Inhale again, lengthen front. Exhale side. So while you're doing this, you want to watch as you rotate that this knee isn't dropping out to the side or dropping in. You kind of keep the knee facing forward. And then when you've done about uh, eight to 10 reps on that side, you can switch over to the other side, patting the back knee if you feel for comfort or to level out the hips here. So start to um, just slightly tailbone tuck. Lengthen your spine. You can reverse the cross of the hands. We're going to inhale and as you exhale, rotate. Try not to hike your hip up. Inhale, center. Exhale, rotate. Inhale again. One more time, inhaling and exhale. Great. So yes, again, try eight to 10 reps on that side. See how your rib cage feels after and let me know. Thanks for joining me. I'll see you next time.